All right, hey everyone, Wanderbots here, and welcome to Greece. G R I S. I thought it was Gris, but according to the press blast I got for it, it's Greece. It's an atmospheric platformer, and it's downright gorgeous. Yeah, we we had seen it on display at PAX West, and uh, sued a button for it, and it was so beautiful, it was just so beautiful. Can't wait to see it. I don't like her little hands. They're so weird. They're oh. like it's weirding me out a little bit that she has teeny little fingers at the end of them. So it seemed like she was singing and had lost her voice. Yep. Awakened and then the world crumpled around her, whatever those those hands that cradled her were. Now she's falling. Do I have any control over this? Nope, doesn't look like it. Yeah, her tiny arms are freaking me out. Yeah, it's like... Is the rest of her body just like this weird pseudo-stick figure thing? It or... reminds me of how there have been a number of games with the the flowing skirt, the, the journeys. And... Yeah. See, I originally didn't think that... I thought she'd just have like the little spike feet and no arms, but no, she has arms. And they have like teeny little fingery things. <laughs> it's so weird. No, well, it's not a big deal. They, I just There's so much animation to this game. Isn't it, for the most part, all hand animated? I think so, yeah. I So I looks... tried talking to the developers about this, and I hate to say it, but their accents were so... They, were, they had great accents, and I could barely understand a word they said. And I was like, I, I'm just going to appreciate this game visually at all. What country? I don't know. Are they... Cause I think I thought... they're European. I'm 90% certain they are. Because with Greece, isn't that the way you say Might gray? Might be French. Yeah, like, yeah. That's I, what I, was I don't thinking. entirely remember. Can I? Nope. Well, I can depression at the stairs. I was going to say, can I jump? But the answer is no. I've got more of a flop button. I love the animation, though. Oh, yeah. Her hair especially. I like the film grain. Normally I hate film grain on these games, but it looks... Mm -hmm. It's very appropriate that with, in this and case. paper textures. When you have paper textures Yeah, I grain. guess this is more of a paper texture than a film grain. It just kind of has a film grain effect. They definitely have the ink, watercolor, and other wet mediums employed. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the, In the demo that we had seen, she was sort of navigating a kind of... I don't know, like vertical maze, and there was a, a bird pursuing her. There are several birds that had just flown by. Is it where you're trying to reach the sky again? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know where we're going to go. Greece is French. <laughs> okay, thought so. Yeah. Their accents didn't sound French, but maybe... I don't well, know. I it knew, was really loud I knew at Pax that, West. I knew that Greece meant gray. Probably back when most of the students in the United States have to have this intermediate, well, not intermediary course, this uh, beginner's introduction to Spanish, German, and French. I love these, like, weird line things. <laughs> They're cool. Well, it resembles a tree. Yeah, sort of like a tree, but more geometric, and I love it. Mm -hmm. Oh, wait. Oh. That, can you walk backwards? Yeah. Keep going. Look, they have little feet. Yeah. Uh, uh, 
I see you there, scuttling. It, are they hermit crab rocks? Yeah, they're the crab rocks, crab runes. Oh, I love the parallax on the clouds. Because there's layers to the floofy aspects in the back. Might even be 3D, uh, hard to say. So we're in this wasteland, and there are ruins. Ruins that have sunken into the sands. I wanted to play the demo when we were at uh, PAX West, but, but I think line the line was... was <laughs> it was like an hour or two long. It was ridiculous. Because mm -hmm. the demo wasn't short, and so eventually they're like, well, you remember the press? Do you want to just play it? And I'm like, no, I don't want to deny people this. I'm going to be playing it anyway. <laughs> That's one nice thing about uh, being a YouTuber. I know I will always get to play these games. So I'm not oh. too much of a rush. I like how that firefly sort of leaves a constellation pattern in its Yeah, shape. instead of just like a smooth curve. Mm -hmm. So is this a companion? Yeah, I guess. Exactly. Yeah, it really does. Okay, so I can go back. I don't know if there's a reason for me to go back. Actually, I probably have to go... Uh, let's go to the right for a bit, then. Let's hmm. see what happens. Just to see if there is an end? Yeah. Well, that's a pretty tree, too. It is a pretty tree. Ah. Yes. Ah, okay, there's a cliff. <laughs> the uh, impassable gray wall of no passing. Well, it, it was quite sheer. Oh, see? There's that... The watercolor again. Yeah. Creating the underside of the, I, the rock face. I want to try watercolors again. I haven't... I have tons of watercolor materials right behind me yeah, if you want to. Yeah, I just to. don't have time. No, I know. I would love it if there was a proper watercolor, like, digital painting thing. Oh, we got a second one. Okay. Oh, so they're like, they're like, uh... They're points. They're building blocks of a sort, yeah. Mm -hmm. And that looks like a tower that may have at once housed a bell but it's vacant currently. See, this reminds you of Child of Light. I've never gotten around to playing that game. I'd like to, but I mean... Oh, so it's a stair. Before we even started Whoa. this. Now is that some kind of manta ray beam? It's the memory of the laundry she forgot on the line. Hey! <laughs> Come back to haunt her. <laughs> Your sheets are being rained on, woman. <laughs> it's what you get for having weird dreams. It wants you to cross there? Did you draw that line yourself? No, the constellation things the constellation did it for me. Created. Yeah. I would definitely have actually those those problems back when I lived with my parents. Mm -hmm. Uh the realization that the laundry is still out on the line during and, a rainstorm. Yeah, and it's it's Wait, raining. Oh. Yeah. You, okay, so falling damage is not a thing. I don't think so. I don't even know what this does, but I did it. Does it send you into the sky? Uh, no. Oh, okay. I, it's just a weird thing that you can interact with. I just seen it earlier and I was like, well, can't reach it one way, so I guess we'll just come back at some point. And you weren't able to connect the lines on the right. Uh, I will be able to now. Uh, oh, they're just over to the right here. Yes. I don't have to go back up. Oh, so you've been, you've been accruing more of those. Yeah, there's one at the top of the tower. Creatures. Yep. And they'll help you cross, because now there'll be enough points. Yep. So this is. I don't think this game has much for combat. I think you do have to like run away and move around things. Probably hide and avoid enemies if there are any. Yeah, there's there's like the one angry bird creature, and that's about it. Oh. Fingers. It's a hand. Yeah. Probably akin to the ones that she was sitting in before. Oh. Everything's tinged with red. 
and especially the fingers. Is it blood or achievement unlocked? And red. it just simply says red. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe we start off with grease and Gray. then slowly and then we get the rainbow color and turns out this entire game is an advertisement for skittles did you know there was an action rpg on ps2 that was just a giant advertisement for skittles no it was actually not a bad game if i remember right i i don't remember anything about it but it was actually one of those games that was like weirdly good oh this allows you to wait you need two of those yeah and i already found one Okay, so, so we, we need to find the other side. We have to find the other one somewhere. Oh, a hanging pot. Doesn't look like I can climb the pots. I always like the trees when they're assembled in this fashion, the the curved branches. Yeah. Oh, where are they ascending to? Oh, they return to being stars, and you can see... Quite a number of them. How many aligned. I'm gonna need? Substantial amount. Oh, a bird. A little one. Okay. Now oh. this you need to get how many? Eight? Yeah. Or seven. A boatload of them. I couldn't count because you sped off. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, seven. Mm hmm I wonder if this is some kind of low-keyed level select situation going on. Um. Hmm. We might have to go back? Possibly. Nope. Oh, you can't. You can't return. Oof. Do I have any other buttons? And you can't, say, descend into that small hole right there, can you? No. Maybe I just keep going the... Yeah, yeah I just keep going to the right There's a stairway. Here. There's a staircase. I got it. Yeah, it looks like there's a bunch of these things that we're supposed to unlock? Mm-hmm. But you have to find those circular... Motifs. Well, let's just keep wandering around until we find. Whoa! We'll probably be able to go back there at some point. It's like you're sliding down all this red, red pigment. I love sand surfing. This is. Oh man, Journey's coming out on PC. I'm excited for that. I I really like these like atmospheric. Was it the sun rising, or just passing? Just passing. I, I don't know, I love games like this. Journey, uh... Let's see, what was the other one that I played earlier? Uh... What was the game? Far Lone Sales. Also similar to this. A couple different games at this point that are just... more kind of moody atmospheric as opposed to, like, direct gameplay. And, I don't know, I'm a huge fan of... of the style. Okay, so that rock is in the way. I always go to the left first if I can avoid it. It's interesting it. because that rock seems to be in the foreground as opposed yeah, to the Yeah, that's what background. I was thinking. It's like maybe I can sneak behind it. Maybe there's things. I like the little sparkles there on the left. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and those streams of sand are coming off the pathway too. Let's see. Will I play Journey again? Yes, I will probably replay it when it hits PC because I, I really like Journey and I don't mind doing another playthrough. It'd be what that's one of the few games that I'd almost want to do like a uh oh, I'm no longer in control. Oh. Okay. She jumped up. Oh. There's the title. And yeah, there definitely seems to be an orbit. And I didn't know if that third one was supposed to be akin to Earth because it had the moon orbiting it. But the cent the one closest to the center was seemed to have rings of its own, and Mercury, as far as I know, it doesn't have any. Aha! Of course. I found the thing. It's way too close. Most of the ringed planets are gas giants. 
as I recall. Yep. Rings are cool. They I are. uh playing uh what was it? No Man's Sky, they added rings to certain planets. It does make me wonder what kind of a ring we have now that we might have so much trash satellite Ugh. space discarded space that stations is going to be a serious junk. problem like 50 years from now probably i'm just wondering how many satellites are currently in operation fair chunk it always surprises me how many of them are privately owned mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. i love all the floaty bits like the floating rocks and stuff yeah oh so they're i don't know if they're mountains or if they're pyramids the weather in the distance. oh yeah then, those are probably and then the weather vanes yeah Oh! Uh oh. Sandstorm! Well, I guess I'm just here for a while. Right, maybe I'm safe. And it looks like they actually used real smoke effects. Yeah. Like uh, footage as opposed really? to animation. I'll have to pay more attention. The problem is, it's like, it's it's hard to tell if it's real or simulated at this point, considering how. Um... See? Oof. I don't... That might be simulated. Uh, it's... So the basic physics uh, engines required to, like, generate that sort of thing have gotten... More sophisticated So over much time. better over the years, yeah. Hmm. Jumping oh. makes you go faster. This is, like, weirdly dramatic. <laughs> for the... Well, the music definitely... Yeah. ...imparts that, that sensation, that feeling. The desire for a kind of brevity. I don't know if I want to go... You probably want to go... I actually don't know if there's, like, much of a difference between up and down. Like it. Oh. There's another one of those. Oh, the little star thing is over there. Yeah, but I wasn't going to be able to reach it. Well, make make sure this that you way. can take shelter for a while. Yep. And then you can go back and I just and have to, to hang out here. It. Let's see, is this kind of like Castlevania music? That'd be <laughs> pretty great if at some point we have to fight Dracula, but I'm not, <laughs> not betting on it. Oh, hey! And we're the little mobile rock creatures. Mm -hmm. So how in the dickens am I supposed to get across to... Oh, there's a jump point. Well, now that you have two, you should oh, be able to Oh, now that I get... have two, I should be able to... I see. But will you be able to make it in time without getting blown away? Ah. Now we're good. We just, we just clutch the ground. Okay, that's good. But obviously being on less grounded structures makes you airborne and... Tumbles you away. Yeah, it tumbles us off. I'll probably just chill here instead of trying to race it. Mm hmm. That makes sense. I know that red is usually described as a aggressive, angry color, but for some reason, this particular red Moody. is more pleasant. Perhaps it's because it verges on. Maroon? Well, there are maroon parts, but then there are also Some orange reds. Some roses and... yeah. Yeah. I love just the geometry and all of these, like, structures. Mm -hmm. It looks really nice. Oh, oh, man. oh! It's a giant crab oh, creature! No. Oh no, what have I done? I'm in the belly of the beast, and the beast is creepy. <laughs> <laughs> Well, there's there's an orbit thing right there. Yeah, I'm going back for it. There you go. And now I suppose you make your exit. Well, uh, after maybe the storm. I just hang out here for a bit. It even has a little spire at the top. Let's see. Have we played Bound? Yes, we have. Uh, played it the night it came out, I think. It was like the night or the night after. It was a nice game. I think I like this better. Bound was a little bit more... Hmm, what would I say? 
maybe too al allegorical for my tastes. Can you remind me what that one was? That was the, oh. Uh, Bound was the one where we were like a ballerina and everything was like super low poly. I... We played it on PS4 a while back. Oh. I wonder how we can get that to crumble appropriately. Hmm. I don't know. It almost seems like you'd have to dislodge it from beneath. Yeah, but I don't have the ability to do... Is there a way for you to get blown back into it, into that cavernous space? Maybe we get like a power to come back or... I don't know. I'm gonna see what happens when it blows us here. No. Oh, no, you just clutched the ground again. And jumping in the air doesn't make you go any higher. No. The one thing I could think of is we wait here and then we jump and see if it like knocks us backwards. But we might need movement tech. I don't mm -hmm. know if there's movement tech in this game. That's the one question. And you hadn't jumped onto it from above. No, I'm not you? I'm not seeing anything. Yeah, so we might need an ability or Maybe we should have fallen on it? Mm -hmm. Yeah, just to make it crumble, but you can't get back up there. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I don't know. Well, it's okay. There's an awful lot of rods. Oh! Sanctuary! Oh. Oh, maybe this is the movement tech. Require this is the movement tech. Yeah, we're getting something. It's oh. You have gained the ability to vastly increase your girth! <laughs> Whammo! Uh, uh, <laughs> You're being a little loud there, but... I'm in all of this last. You just... What an absolute unit. So... They drew a square about her, and she's able to morph her cloak into that shape, which also vastly increases her, her I am weight. the cubic woman! Well, there's... there's the block ability. When do you don't scare me now? Not in the face of how just gosh darn cubicle I am. <laughs> 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 I can move forward! Yes! Alright! We are slow running this game. <laughs> okay, well now you can run. <laughs> I'm going as fast as I can. You don't need to, <laughs> to scuttle about the same way that I'm the just, crab I'm just rocks enjoying do. myself for a moment here. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'll make it someday. Wind, rain, snow, or apocalypse. It doesn't matter to me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I like this. I do like the transparent watercolor. Like smoke effect that we're... Well, what's here? Yeah. yeah, yeah. Because you know how sometimes people film it when it's slow bleeding across a piece of paper? You see that at the edges. Gaze upon my vastness yonder wind and weep, for ye shall not move me. <laughs> She's gonna need a shower after this, though. Is her hair's all exposed? Mm hmm. Oh, I hate getting oh. sand in my hair. Wait a minute. Hey, so... look! It, the temple's weeping, at least. That'll do. Yeah. So I think this is also allegorical that this whole game is existing in her head. Just mm -hmm. like in. Um... Grappling with her emotions, sadness. Yep. And it's interesting to have red as the I, I don't know if we're going to explore different emotions or if it's going to be different facets of what's currently creating turmoil within her but keep going to the right there's also a ledge down oh there was a way to smash down rock critter but it 
He'll help carry you across. Both of these look like points of no return. We'll smash down. You don't think that... You can jump up to the right, can't you? Well, you don't think? I don't know. I would think that you could jump up to the right. Or up from the right, I should say. I guess if I can make this jump, I can probably make that other jump. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the thing under the bell looks breakable. I'm just trying to decide which is progress and which is not. Because I'd hate to soft lock myself in, in one way versus the other. Because it doesn't look like we've got a stage select. Mm -mm. I think you can should be able to jump up from that. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Absolutely. We should probably go back. Okay, that's a stairway. Yeah, this looks like progress. Don't go too far. Um, it might, I was worried about it starting a cutscene or something. But then again, it could be one of those things where the right side isn't progress and jumping I, down. I, yeah, I don't... Well, can you investigate that? Uh, the breakable spot? The breakable spot, because it's possible that there isn't a place you can come up from that. I think we should just try it. Because it doesn't look like it can come back from it. Oh no. I just hope that there isn't something off to the right that we can't get back to. This goes much further This down looks pretty than... definitive. Yeah. However... What? Oh. Hades, I'm coming for you! We, we probably missed a thing off to the I'm right. I'm gonna smack you right in the Greek. Oh. Butterflies. And are you just building up more and more with every urn you crush? It looks like it, yes. Maybe we've gained a new power? Or they're a victim. Flight. Oh. Maybe you should have gone off to the right and the left before. Never mind. No, it doesn't allow you to jump off. Oh, I, we should have gone to the right first. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe we could get back. But the color scheme has changed. We, we, we plunged down into a room full of white. It looks like we could go back, though. Because mm -hmm. that, that whole area with all the, all the circles made it look like we can go back freely. Mm -hmm. And with the powers we gain, it's probably going to go much faster. Okay. So I'm not honestly too buggered by it if it turns out that we've locked ourselves in. So what's our next? What's the uh, what's the next power we get? What do you think? Uh, the ability to become long, like really long and thin. To roll. <laughs> it's a spherical woman, except for her to head. Fly. I I'd like a little bit of a flight. <laughs> except for her head, which still sticks out of the ball. So when she rolls, it's like flap, flap. Oh <laughs> no. I mean, we have it when we go cubic. So now is this gonna move? Is it gonna grow immensely long legs and start to trundle along? You thought this was a rock, but no, surprise, it is also a living creature, filled with other living creatures, just like you, living creature. <laughs> there are always those amusing stories where people find out that the planet that they're living on or in isn't a planet at all, and it is some kind of massive creature. Okay, that sets the wheels in motion. But you need you you can make two on that side, but you need three for the other side. Yeah, I just have to wait for it to push back. Oh, this is cool. Mm-hmm. Clockwork. Oh, I was really hoping mm -hmm. I could like slam onto it and like turbo slide or some cool ability like that. I do hope we get like a double jump. Oh. You are waited for a moment. Yep. It tilts it off. I wonder if I can break that. I bet that's actually the point. Did it get caught? It looks like it got caught against the other vein. 
And now you can jump up to the right to get that little star. Assuming I don't miss the jump. I do hope we get a double jump. This feels like a kind of game that needs like a double jump and a float jump. Mm-hmm. It should be good enough. Oh yeah, and then you can get up to that. And then maybe take the vein? Yeah, from here. Ah. I don't know what else to call them, but they look like little orbits. Orbit essences to me. Yeah. Whoa. How horrible would that be if it actually broke the rock and sent us, like, hurtling to the ground? These... Yeah, the pipes look so fragile. Yeah, it does not look like it's meant to withstand, uh, cubic lass mm -hmm. at her girthiest. We still have that red dot in the sky. Is it a kind of Probably moon the or sun? sun? No, the sun is big and white. True. That might be a little moon. Watch it actually just be like Majora's Mask and it keeps getting closer and closer until it crushes the world. And that's the entire point of the game and you're trying to avoid that. This is pretty music. I want more games like that where you just straight up see the moon come in your direction. Mm. Oh. Black butterflies again. Oh, bird. Maybe? No. Oh. You oh. had to crush that so that you could... Did that send pieces right, I can't flying go to the direction. right? No, 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 no. Or, it, it, yeah. sort of? I don't actually know if it moved the pieces. 